Hey, it's Tez. Do I want to go on a trip? No, I don't want to go on the UK tour. I went to the last time and sucked. It's just another stupid match. It's, it's just I'm trying to get through this Let's Play as quick as possible because again my PS2 is crapping up. As you may notice the quality isn't as good as it used to be. It's because I'm using different cables because the one I was using originally doesn't work anymore. <laughs> oh snap. Let me introduce the most intelligent and sophisticated woman in the WWE, Trish Stratus. Thanks RVD, but you forgot one thing. I am the sexiest diva in the WWE. That's right, the corporation has the sexiest diva in the WWE. It's no wonder I couldn't choose her. Victoria, tonight we're going to have a mixed match, but I'm going to kick your butt. Trish has requested a match. I hope it's a Brown Panties match, Jaya. Okay, I, let me guess, I'm teaming with Victoria. Yeah, I'm teaming with Victoria. Oh, Triple H and Shawn Michaels, huh? <laughs> Chris Jericho beat up Hardy again. Okay, cool. Uh, this shouldn't be too hard, I don't think. Now. Hello, Kevon Ash. Cool. I really couldn't give a damn about this match, so. Come outside the ring. Oh, f come on. Fine. Wow. Punching, doing a double axe hand onto his head lands onto his stomach because he's so tall. Okay. Are you coming to get me, Riff? Okay, you are. Okay, cool. Sweet! DQ for Kevin Ash. I really kind of use that table trick a lot more than I should, don't I? Your strength rating determines how much damage you inflict on your opponent. Now loading. Oh, the lights are dim. That was a very interesting match. Yeah, it was, wasn't it? But I want you to see something a little more interesting. RVD, are you ready? Oh, crap. I wonder... Oh, crap. Damn, where have I seen this before? The Power Trip Express. Bar gold! <coughs> oh, my God. The Power Trip Express has just been decimated. Wow, do you know how much that cost them? The Power Trip Express is definitely out of commission. Man, Lesnar is not happy about this and he'll definitely be seeking revenge. You know, I actually wouldn't be surprised if the WWE used the storyline again. I really wouldn't. In fact, I kind of expect them to. I mean, they recycled that milk, spraying everyone in the ring with milk, like... How many times? Like three? And uh... Some other angles where you pick a name out of the draw and it's like the most weakest jobber there is. Like Shannon Moore. Yeah. I guess storylines and games are good, but they're better if they're their own. If they're actually, you know, a custom made storyline for the game. That's when the storylines are better, not just kind of recycled from actual WWE programming. Otherwise, it feels like, you know, what's the point? You might as well just watch the actual storyline instead of reenacting it. I don't know, some people really like reenacting it. And, if, you know, that's cool. I got no problem with that. But for me, it's just like, you know, I enjoy more 
more custom storylines just, you know, for the game. Like 06. Hey, listen up. Tonight I have a singles match against Lesnar, okay? But I don't think he's here tonight because we crushed their damn bus. Ha ha ha. Wait a second, is that Lesnar in that pickup truck? It's the new Power Trip Express. That's obviously a declar declaration of war. It's also a quick way to get to the ring. That's exactly what Stone Cold did. I don't remember when, but he did that. Hmm. Huh. Oh well. Who am I to complain, huh? Pick up drop. Oh, Okay, so this storyline's okay. I think the, mo the whole faction invasion storylines are getting pretty old. Like with Nexus. Uh. Oh, no, 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 crap. Oh, shoot. Oh, this is kind of boring fighting Nash. Guess I'm gonna have to pull out the old table again. Yeah, you take that. Funny how that doesn't disqualify you. See, it's like that. It doesn't disqualify you because you can't get away with it because it is a game. Kevin Nash is kicking my ass. See, again. Bang. Yeah. The quality isn't as good because I'm using the regular component cables. No, no, not component. Composite cables. Composite cables, they're like the typical yellow, red, white cable. I used to use the uh, component cables, which were, which were the green, oh crap, the green, blue, and red ones. And it had two extra ones for sound, so I thought that was pretty cool. Oh, come on, just grab. Oh, I'm already yellow. I think I'm going to lose this match. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, shoot. Well, what the hell's wrong with me? I can't do anything. I'm too tired. Okay, just do a move on him. That should make me feel a little bit better. There we go, now you're yellow. Now I feel a lot better. Come on, just grab me. Yes, there we go. Good, thank you. Could have done that before. <laughs> you gotta love how Lesnar just gets back up and stares at them. Hey, it's Mr. RVD. Lesnar, I was watching your match backstage. I think you're tough enough to be the same, be in the same ring as me. Why don't you and I have a singles match unless you're scared? Last man standing, hardcore. Um, hardcore match. That's fine with me. This Sunday, just like the pay-per-view name, I will give you no mercy. A historic match between has been booked for the match for the much anticipated No Mercy. The leaders of the two factions are going to face off. There will be a lot of pride and egos at stake. I can't wait to see it. <sighs> oh crap. Okay, so. Okay, no mercy, Little Rock, Arkansas. I think that's how you say it. Start program. No mercy. The bomb is ticking away on this feud. This hatred has history. Do you think you can beat me? Lesnar is enraged. 
a fatal shot. A blow which he'll never forget. There is only one winner. He overcame all obstacles. There will be hell unleashed. Cool. Gotta love that music, huh? No mercy. Yeah, good old fireworks, you're always the same. Okay, move. Who can I move? Even back to Booker T. I don't want to talk with him. Okay, see what match I have. Art Van... Oh, of course I got Art Van Damme. Yeah, Victoria beat Trish. That's good. Come on, Jericho, win. Oh, crap. Okay, Brock Lesnar versus Rob Van Dam. Now I'm gonna beat the hell out of Rob Van Dam. Okay. No, okay. Just beat the hell out of him. Bang! Okay, he gets straight to the hardcore action. No, maybe not. Ooh, he almost kicked me in the face. Take that! Get out of the ring! Woohoo! Cool. Oh no, I meant to throw him in. Never mind. Come on. Get into there. Was that chair? No chair, crap. I think the thing I miss about uh, the older Smackdown games is how in a hardcore match you can't go backstage from here. I don't think so. Oh, I think you can actually. No, never mind, you can. I was mistaken. My bad. I think it's from here you can't go back. I think it's from like the games after this. The SmackDown games after this, you can't really go backstage anymore. Like, from the ring. Which is what I miss. Except wrestlers don't really do that anymore, so I guess that's why they took it out, I don't know. Oh. Crap. Take that. Yeah. Get up there. No. Ugh. I know you can get him up there somehow. There we go. No, no, don't fall off. Oh. Come on, get back up. No, don't go back to the ring. Where the hell are you going? No! Oh, you idiot! Oh, this is why I hate the CPU. Seriously, it just pisses me off. Oh, now you get back outside the ring. There's no count out, you dumb crap. Uh, and I don't know why, I just need to do an F5 on that table up there. I think it's because I haven't done that before. Maybe I have a long time ago, but not recently. Come on now, just just don't fall off, okay? Just, oh crap, I think that was... It's so awkward, that table up there. Just don't... No! Oh my god, come on, come back up. Ugh, no, fuck. Okay, this is really annoying. Like, really annoying. Ah, oh, idiot! Okay, that's it. Yeah, can't beat me, Rob. You know, I got an idea. I'm gonna beat the hell out of him. Ah. No, I'm not done with you. Really piss me off. Get out of the way, crappy ref. There we go. Frog splash. <laughs> I love seeing the finishes. So much fun. Too bad I couldn't hit five and see that table.